I'm Rana, and welcome to my art space. So I joined this challenge hosted by fellow artist Dina Tollefson, and I would like to paint the best sky ever. Hmm. Every sky is beautiful, right? So I'm going on a two-day trip to find the best reference that I can use for my painting for this Sky is the Limit Challenge. city is known as the second summer capital of the Philippines. It's sort of like a proxy to Baguio City because they have lots of similarities like the cool weather, pine trees, and picture taking with horses. Yeehaw! Most of all, Tagaytay is famous for Taal Volcano which would rumble from time to time. I'm glad she's calm today. Low flocked with tourists, there's so much beautiful sceneries to see and capture on camera. So many inspiration can be gathered from here. Well, just be prepared to get a bit physical because of the long forest trail. Another beautiful spot we visited was the Kalerwega Church in Nasugbu, Batangas. Jam-packed with luscious greens and breathtaking sceneries, I also gathered inspiration from here. To get away from the flocking Holy Week vacationers, I climbed a long flight of stairs. Again, there's so much to see here. Even though the sky seemed threatening for a while. But I soon forgot all that fatigue because I was so enthralled with the beauty of the sky and everything around it. began working on my artwork after coming home. I scoured through my gallery to choose the best subject that I like for my oil painting. And I chose an unlikely candidate. That's the last picture in the trip. The one taken while we were on the way home. This picture stood out among the rest because of the over-domineering clouds that are cloaking the setting sun. Filtered by the darkened car glass, it looked even more vintage, triggering nostalgia from our two-day trip. All that bright blue that I've captured earlier have now been fading away as we close the curtain for this trip. Slowly, it fades into gray as the light is pushed back further away from my eyes. It's the moment of when the skies are at the brink of melancholy. The sun is slowly making its exit, just like your travel buddies who kept on smiling and waving as they walk away from you. I have not mastered oil paints, but I would love to come back to them from time to time. Making an oil painting can be a slow but beautiful process, leading me to meditate more on my work and the moment when it was taken. 
Wisps of pink orangey clouds reflect the sun's last energy, drifting like pieces of the memories collected during that travel. But bigger and thicker clouds were also there, and I thought they were trying to spoil all the fun because they are casting a shadow and they are covering the sun. The shadows and light seem to be in a battle in the space, mirroring my inner turmoil of whether to stay in paradise or to go back to reality. The struggle can be seen with how I struggle to create clouds because I have not practiced on the subject for quite some time. But it's good to go back to this kind of paintings from time to time as I renew my perspective about the sky and its beauty in the growing twilight. I chose this picture because it reflects the moment that I was in. It marks the end of a vacation, but at the same time signifies the hope of a new adventure unfolding soon. Sunsets are not the end of all things. They are just a pause of what we had gone through, whether they are joy or pain. They signify the time to reflect, to unload the burdens we've collected that day, and retain the lessons we have learned and we can carry for tomorrow. Without sunsets, there can be no sunrises. Without the end of a chapter, there can never be a new beginning. These new beginnings we should look forward to, for each new day is more wondrous than the one that came after them. If you like this video, please click the like button. And if you're here in my channel for the first time, do click subscribe. And also click the bell button so you would be notified of my future videos. I'd also like to thank Nina for inviting me in this challenge. And I also hope you check out her page so you can see all her great artworks. Again, I'm Rama and thank you very much for joining me here in my art space. And I hope to see you again in my next video. Bye! Also click the bell future videos. Why are these people so noisy? So I this challenge created by Dina Art. Uh,